Well, well, well. What a smart little detective you turned out to be. Turned out to be. My one mistake has always been very slightly overestimating just how stupid you are. Overestimating. Come back to the orphanage, detective, detective. And I'll deconstruct you like a flimsy philosophical position. Philosophical position. Well, you heard the man. We're back, everyone. We're gaming by gaslight. And I finally, after... I have no idea. Four or five hours, probably, just wandering around the city, utterly refusing to break in and use a guide, because my own ego is almost big enough to match that of the Riddler, and I could not possibly stand the idea that I got help instead of solving them all on my own. But we solved them all, we found every single riddle, got everything, uh, and uh, like I said, in the last episode, I'm probably not going to actually show all that on camera because it would be quite tedious. Just me and you, Nigma. Time to finish this. So, it's off for the moment we've all been waiting for. Let's get ready to rumble. <laughs> uh, I don't have a good enough voice to get that real. I can't even remember the name of the famous announcer for boxing. Can't remember his name. And all of that whole no way you're catching me going thing. Near anyway, now, my but this is what we've been waiting for. Batman versus the Mecha Riddler. I am loving this. Cannot wait. I tell you, cannot wait. Scarecrow pulling this on Halloween. Guess he's got a sense of humor after all. Wonder if Catwoman's going to be back to help us out or if it's going to be all us. Oh, wait, wait. I don't recall that. There's some writing on the door, what's it say? Can you detect a mine such as yeah, yes. Yes, Nigma. We're Just seven meters away. Enigma. Time to finish this. Oh, this is beautiful, my friends. It's time. The moment we've all been waiting for. Batman versus the Mecha Riddler. Okay. Two, well, four, Dark three. Knight, it seems you have earned the right to die at my mechanical hands. <laughs> but we do not meet as equals. In fact, you literally have not a hope of victory. Oh, I wish I could say that I have found this one-sided rivalry of ours intellectually stimulating, but in truth, I grew bored of you long ago. Killing you here will finally liberate me to engage in more edifying pursuits. Goodbye, detective. You will be neither missed nor... Okay. Now, um, since Catwoman is not here to help us, I'm not entirely sure. Man. You know, can you imagine if Nigma actually put all his time to better use? What just happened? Sorry, oh. Lee, but it looks like you're cheating to me. What are you doing here? This is not your fight, cat. Eddie, sweetie, you invited me, remember? Then you tied me to a chair. You didn't have to come. And you asked me to be grateful. Hard for you. Whoa! That actually did almost no damage. You shouldn't be here. You shouldn't have got this far. Here you go. Ha <laughs> um. ha! Oh, why did I switch back to Catwoman? Ow!
Okay. Use your pie. This is the end. My victory. I just reward you. Gotta be honest, I do feel a little bit bad for poor old Nigma. And my puck. No, you don't. No, I don't want to. I want him to be blue. Dual team takedown? Oh, nope. Come on. There we go. That's what I wanted. Come on there, Eddie. Don't be a sore loser. Come on. Ow. Um. I'm afraid not. I don't, whoa, whoa, run! My robots are indestructible. Whoa. Okay, I'm not entirely sure what I did wrong. I don't think I changed anything. You can't win! Oh, damn it. Did you know, Eddie? I don't know. I'm having my doubts that you really saw all this coming. Muscular oppression ends here. Muscular oppression. Oh, come on, Nigma. Don't be that kind of guy. Oh. Love poor Enigma. No, that's not it. Um, you can't hurt me. You think you can defeat my creation? Okay. Alright, I've got to be honest, I'm not sure I understand how that next phase of the fight is supposed to work. Oh. No. I quite like being in one piece, thank you. It's kind of weird how he never changes into a color that... You shouldn't be here. You got this far. Or am I supposed to uh maybe play as Catwoman this time? Why, thank you. How did you do it? How did you call them all? Oh, there we go. I think maybe I was just attacking the wrong hand. It was perfect. My perfect victory. Oh, it's all right, Nigma. Oh, oh, come on. Why'd you have to attack that one? That one? Alright. Whoa. 
I can't see what he's doing. But I can and did. Oh, I will not kill you, sir. Alas, Riddler, you're gonna have to acknowledge my victory today. <laughs> I don't take all day about it. Ugh. I've gotta be honest, I feel a bit bad for the old boy. I've gotta be honest. Oh, come on. Oop. Oh, why do I always get an itch? One of those things, isn't it? You always, you, you always have to scratch something, in this case my nose, when you can't. I think this next beatdown should probably take. Go. Kill them, Riddler, That's not what I intended to. Are you talking to yourself now, Eddie? Whoa. Bobu. Okay. Hey there, Riddler. So, what is it going to be this time? Here we go, come on! Punch him out! Punch him out! A little more! One, two! Oh! Oh, come on! Oh! Ba bam! Oh! That's gotta hurt. I do feel bad for him, but, you know, he brought this on himself. How many times, by the way, have I said I feel bad for the Riddler? He's kind of an underrated villain at times. For the daring last minute rescue. It was very heroic. It was, it was under control. <laughs> sure it was. Now be a good damsel and bestow a kiss on your gallant hero. Play nice. You're not playing at all. No, I'm not. Not anymore. And what's that supposed to mean? It means this is the end, Selena. It means we can't. I can. I will see you again, right? No one will. Gotham needs something more, something worse to defend her. She needs a new myth, a legend more powerful than I can be right now, a legend that can only rise from the ashes of the Batman. Some things you can't do alone, Bruce. And some things you have to. Aw, oh, come on. Just call if you need me. I won't. I know. I just wanted to say it. <sighs> you know... Life would be so much easier for Batman, for Bruce Wayne, if he would just you know, balance his personal and professional life a little bit more. I think he'd be quite happy with Selena. <laughs> right? I think so, anyway. Wow, we've done everything and we still don't even have nearly enough points and things for all the possible upgrades. That is insane. Eh, no, why not? I'm sure you'll figure it out. No, no, no. You cheated. Catwoman cheated. She stole my victory from me. A fight I couldn't win? That doesn't even fit your definition of playing fair. It was fair. If you weren't able to bypass the robot's multi-layer encryption, decipher their unique operating system, and reprogram them mid-battle, that doesn't mean you get to call in assistance. <laughs> no. 
You know, it is funny how all of Batman's villains do reflect part of his own persona, really. And I guess that's kind of the point, right? But I just feel like pointing that out. And also, as I was saying about Riddler being an underrated villain, he's probably one of my favorite Bat villains. And when's the last time he's really got to shine as, like, the, uh, like, leading plot? Some people would say he probably doesn't have what it takes to, like, be the main villain of an entire story arc, but I would argue otherwise. I mean, wasn't Clue Master assigned the big, like, villain in one of the recent story arcs? I haven't really been keeping up with the new 52 so much, but I recall hearing that. Of course, I suppose that only worked because no one would see such a thing coming. Also, sorry if I just spoiled a major storyline. Out you go, Enigma. Ha! I could have brought me here twice as quickly. Well, riddle me this. Was Green proud and ass kicked all over? How exceedingly droll. I won't be needing a lawyer, you jumped up security guard. I will represent myself. Hey, go oh. for it. Oh. You forget, you bothersome bat. Every time you overcome my puzzles, I learn that little bit more about you. Soon enough, there will be a riddle that leads to me. 